The 49ers just fired Steve Wilkes. Kyle Shanahan spoke to the media yesterday and indicated that he didn't expect to lose any of his coaches, but then he slept on it and decided that Wilkes was the problem and he relieved him of his duties. This really shouldn't come as a surprise. They didn't give Wilkes a ringing endorsement after the Super Bowl and they never really supported him. They brought him in and said, whatever your instincts are, whatever ideas you have for this defense, forget them. We want you to do what we do. We want you to learn our system. We want you to be D'Amico Ryans. And, you know, he couldn't be. They had him up in the booth. They brought him down to the sideline. It seemed like Kyle Shanahan was second guessing him and undercutting him every step of the way, which really makes it hard for a guy to get the respect of the players. But despite all that was going against Steve Wilkes, he held the Chiefs to 19 points in regulation. 19. I mean, he wasn't perfect in the Super Bowl. He didn't come through at the end, but he held the Chiefs to 19 points in regulation. Meanwhile, Kyle Shanahan's offense was dreadful the entire game. Who coached better in the Super Bowl, Steve Wilkes or Kyle Shanahan? Steve Wilkes. The answer is Steve Wilkes. And if you were looking to some, for someone to scapegoat for this loss, it's Shanahan, not Wilkes, because Shanahan is the one who decided to get the ball first in overtime because he didn't want to give the ball back to Patrick Mahomes. No, no, no. It's because he wanted the third possession. No, no, no. It's because his defense was tired. That was Kyle's mistake. There was never going to be a third possession. The Chiefs were going to go for two if they, kicked a, if they scored a touchdown. And the Niners scored a touchdown before then. So the Niners lost the Super Bowl for one reason. Shanahan wasn't prepared for the overtime rules. Not because of Steve Wilkes. So maybe they can get someone better than Steve Wilkes. I'm open-minded. But this is a silly, silly way to assign blame. They're scapegoating Steve Wilkes. How predictable.